Ricoh Theatre Camera Connecting a Ricoh Theatre Camera to an iPad You'll need to make sure that your camera is turned on and that the Wi-Fi icon is showing. Turn your phone over to access the code that you'll need to enter. Open the Rico Theatre app and then click on the middle icon. Here you'll see any cameras that have connected to the device already. If your camera is not showing, click on Connect via Wireless LAN Client Mode. Then you'll need to enter in the serial number. This is the code printed on the tag. You'll see here that there's no other option. This means that I've entered in the wrong code. I've entered two O's instead of two zeros. So I need to click back in and change that. Now I can click join and wait for my camera to be connected. This will disconnect the device from your school Wi-Fi and connect it to the camera Wi-Fi. You'll then be able to see a live version of what is on the camera. You can see I'm moving the camera around and the image on my device moves around as well. I can click on the button at the bottom to take a photo and this camera has the settings set at 10 seconds so I can see the countdown until the photo is taken. Now that my device is connected to my camera I can also go in and change the settings. Here you can see the self timer is set at 10, but if I wanted to change that, I can do this in here. I can also change it from taking photos to filming to portrait by clicking on the top icons. I can go in and see what images are on the camera by clicking on the not transferred and if I want to take a closer look I can click on an image. If I've already got images transferred they appear in the transferred and all the images will appear in the last view. Here I've opened up the image on my device so it has been transferred to the device. You'll see it now shows in the transferred tab. The other way I can connect my camera is by using the Wi-Fi. You can see here my camera shows up. I can enter in the password. Here instead of entering the two first letters, the YP, I just want to put in the digits that appear. So in this case, 00111351. It will then connect my device to the camera. If I've used the camera on that device before, now when I go into the theatre app, it will automatically open up without me having to select the camera. Let's go in and check that now. So here I am, and when I click on that middle button, you'll see I've got that live view of what the camera is seeing. Just note, if you haven't used the camera with the device before and you use the second option to connect your camera, you'll get that pop-up screen that asks you to connect to the device, but you won't have to enter in the password.